We are a small charter management organization in Long Beach, California. We offer a dual language program in English and Spanish, and our focus is on social justice, collaboration, the natural environment, and technology. Charter schools are increasingly having to find other ways of funding. We've made commitments to students, parents, and teachers to provide a high level of education and really an all-inclusive second family, if you will, for students. And so we've made those long-term commitments to be there. And unfortunately, with the state of the economy and the state of deferrals, we find ourselves having to find different options. In my experience, charter school capital is a financial partner that comes in, understands the school, understands the school leaders. They take the time to do that. They're able to sit down with us and create a funding plan and be part of our financial plan, provide the technical expertise to schools, and present it in a straightforward way. There's always a cost to finance. Some of the criticism has been uh, charter school capital and other providers who purchase receivables are taking advantage of charter schools. I think that that really um, diminishes the responsibility that charter school operators have to build not only a solid educational program, but also to build a solid business structure, a business infrastructure that supports that educational program. It's never been a doubt for me that charter school capital is deeply concerned deeply interested in the well-being of schools. And beyond the financial well-being is the ability of schools to continue to provide solid education for students. I'm happy that Charter School Capital is able to work with schools and work with us to help us so that we can continue to meet the needs of our students, parents, and teachers. I view them as a close partner.